Hello everyone, I'm Chin and you can call me Ken. Today I'm going to teach you how to use the Chrono Engine the ABS mode. And since this is a really big plugin, so I'll divide it into few parts. And in this tutorial, I'll teach you the basic of the ABS. And you'll learn how to have your enemy attack you when it touch you, and you can fight it back with an item sword. The first thing you'll need to do is download your Chrono Engine. And then after you do this, go into the JS folder, the plugin folder, and go to your project, go to JS folder, the plugin folder, and this one, today I'm going to skip the title, so I use Yami Skip title. And then go to find the plugin you'll need. I only need Chrono Engine. And then go to your image folder. Go to the Chrono Engine image folder. And copy the Chrono folder. Then this one is optional. Go to your character. And I'm going to use the sword today, so I'll use the sword. Sprite. Just this one. And then you can back to your project. First, you just set up your plugin, and you'll see the parameters over here. Two map is really, really important. The default number is one. And all your skills, items, weapons will base on the two map. Then it was the battle mode. Today I'm going to teach you the ABS mode. So change this to 1. And you're good to go. First it was your tool map. I use map 1 as my tool map. And I usually like to give the map some numbers so you'll be easier to see which event you're using and then create an event all the events over here will be a tool since this is a tool map and you connect your tools to the database this is how this work and I've write some txt file to help you understand. I divided it into two parts. The event and the database. And first we'll start with the event. And inside event there will be two parts. Enemy and tool map. Now we add the tool map and we have our event 1. That means tool ID 1. And inside here just paste this 5 into your comment and this will connect this event to item ID 1 and uh, keep going with the other 4 just paste it one by one And now you have a sword. Then go to your database. Oh, I forgot to put the image. So use the sword image, I just copied. And go to your database and check out your item. I've already renamed it. And this is the icon. The default one is Potion. Then you set the type. Remember, you'll need the HP damage, so this sword can damage your enemy. And you can adjust this one. Then you'll need the two ID. 
This tool ID will connect to your tool map event ID 1, that means this one. And then change the consumable to no, because you don't want a sword that just hit one time and it disappear. And change the scope to enemy. Then you can hit OK. Now we'll need an enemy. So just create a map and I just use the sample map. And create an event and put the enemy inside. And you can make it walk in step in. And inside here, you also use command. And this time, you use this one. Enemy ID. With this one, you can connect this event to your database enemy ID too. And after this, you'll need to change the movement. Change the type to custom and choose your route. Just make it toward to the player. And then the really important one is the script. Put in this script. This touched damage. With this one, when enemy touch you, it attacked you. It caused damage. So set this to true. And then check this one, skip. Then hit OK. Then you'll have an enemy slime. And the damage was based on enemy ID 2. So let's check out the database, the enemy ID 2. Go to your enemy. As you can see, it was slime. And actually this is the default one. So I'll just keep it. Then move your player here and give your player the item you just create. And you can test it. The first thing you'll need to do is equip, so hit Q button, and you can see this is the item I just create. The Q button is for the item, and then hit OK with the sword. Then, if you want to use the item, just hit A, bottom A. <laughs> So it looks like there's something wrong. With my database. So let's check out what's wrong with the database. Okay, so it was this one. And let's tag it again. So first Equip your weapon and hit this line, 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 hit this line. Then the slimes is dead. And this is the tutorial for Chrono Engine ABS mode. And I've teach you the basic scene. And in the later, I'll teach you more about this. And thank you for your watching. If you like it, please thumbs up or subscribe. Thank you very much.